went to the same Catholic church and there was a singles group. Uh, it was the 2939 singles group and I was 26 at the time. So um, that's where we met. We had two first dates. The first one kind of got our signals crossed and uh, at the end of the evening uh, I thought, well, I guess he's not interested. And then a few months later, we were at an event and invited me to go to a movie with him. And the rest is history. Pretty much. Yeah. The movie was Wild Cats with Goldie Hawn. <laughs> and it was a good movie. But the important thing is that we were knowing that we'd rather be alone together somewhere than out with the group at the happy hour. And my favorite part of the movie was the... Oh, <laughs> that he did. <laughs> smooth, you, You're smooth, baby. Yeah. <laughs> so as you renew your vows today, we are all reminded that marriage is a union of two lives and two hearts. Uh, every day is so special with you. Um, Probably the birth of our first child, our daughter. That was pretty be, special. Yeah. And the surprise of our second child. Yeah. <laughs> and just, uh, I don't know, we just grow closer every day and, and not all days are good days, but that's the special part is we know that every single day together is well worth it, whether it's a good day or a bad day. I promise to always be supportive to you. I promise to always be supportive to you. In good times and in bad times. In good times and in bad times. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I promise to love and honor you. I promise to love and honor you. And keep you as long as we both shall live. And keep you as long as we both shall live. And now, special things that really stand out to me are um, when you drive me to work. Yeah. <laughs> so make me coffee in the morning. The little, it's little things, things yeah. that you keep doing make a big difference. I promise to always be supportive to you. I promise to always be supportive to you. In good times and in bad times. In good times and in bad times. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I promise to love and honor you. I promise to love and honor you. And keep you as long as we go shopping. And keep you as long as we go shopping. Our daughter's getting married in July, and uh, she's she lives in France and is marrying a Frenchman. And their philosophy is they get married when they're ready to have children. So I'm expecting grandchildren soon. Uh, our son just graduated from culinary school, so he'll be settling himself. 30 years ago, I made a promise to care forever. Today I renew that promise. Today I renew that promise. And I accept you to myself. And accept you to myself. As the cornerstone of my life. As the cornerstone of my life. I loved you then. I loved you then. I love you still. I love you still. I always have. Always have. And I always will. Uh, our plans are just to spend as much time together as we can and enjoy each other and traveling, cruising is our favorite way to travel. And a couple more long ones I'm sure because we really like the at sea days and we'll probably do Alaska. And, and we'll retire someday, hopefully, <laughs> so I'd have more time to do that. 30 years ago, I made a promise to care for everyone. Today I knew that promise. Today I renew that promise. And I accept you to myself. And I accept you to myself. And the cornerstone of my life. And the cornerstone of my life. I loved you then. I loved you then. I love you still. I love you still. I always have. I always have. And I always will. And I always will. As captain of the Grand Princess, I'm with her so you now renew all your vows and your commitment to each other. May you find strength through the love that binds you together today to continue your days in life and lives in peace and harmony. Brian, you may not kiss Cindy, you're a Brian of 30 years. Thank you.